We were 12 and 2 and finished up with a huge 24 to 14 win over the Boston Patriots. Then, on December 26th, the day after Christmas, 40,242 fans turned out for the championship of the American Football League. We were three-point underdogs, as I re remember, despite beating San Diego twice that year. But my old team had some great weapons, like running back Keith Lincoln, great receiver Dave Kosurek, and Lance Allred. The quarterback was 38-year-old Tobin Roden. Chargers won the coin toss, elected to receive. Leslie Duncan took the kickoff, and the battle began. On the first play from scrimmage, Keith Lincoln ran for 38 yards. Three plays later, Tobin Road hit Dave Kasurik for a 26-yard touchdown pass. We were three and out. Paul McGuire hit a big punt. Then the Chargers started driving again, and then it happened. The play that would change the game all the way around. Keith Lincoln ran out to take a swing pass from Road, and our linebacker, Mike Stratton, read the play. As soon as he hit him, you could hear a crack on the sidelines. When you see it in real speed, Lincoln looks like he got hit by a truck, and he did. He lay down on the ground for five minutes, suffering from broken ribs. On the next play, Charlie Warner intercepted a Tobin road pass, and the Bills' offense took over. First play, I hit Glenn Bass for 20 yards, then 11 yards to my old buddy, Ernie Warlick, and then after an incomplete pass on third down, Pete Goglack got us on the boards with a 12-yard field goal. In the second quarter, the offense really started to click. I threw 18 yards to Albert DeBinion, three great runs by Cookie Gilchrist and Ray Carlton, then Doobie took a reverse for eight yards, and then under some pressure, I hit Ray Carlton for 15 yards. Ray put it over, and the Bills were ahead, 10 to seven. Late in the quarter, we came close to putting in the end zone again, but the Chargers defense stopped me at the 10. Pete Gogolak kicked another field goal, and we were up 13 to seven. The Chargers came out, fired up in the second half, trying to get something going. Tobin Rote tried to throw away a pass. Mike Stratton made a great play and intercepted it. Both teams battled through a scoreless third quarter, and then we took control of the game, as I remember. On first down, I hit Glenn Bass at the Charger 35. He broke some tackles and raced to the San Diego one-yard line. Two plays later, I punched it in. We took a 20-7 lead and never looked back. Fans went crazy. They even tore down the goalposts before the game was over. We were champions of the AFL for the very first time. And I enjoyed my dream to be carried off the field on the shoulders of my teammates. I think football gives you a special perspective on our country, that it's not, it's not um, homogeneous, it's heterogeneous. It's uh, people of different colors and different backgrounds and uh, different uh, beliefs and uh, when you go in a huddle you got to forget all that stuff and see who can perform who can block and tackle and run and catch and pass um.